All right, what's up guys? It's Risky here. Welcome to a uh, little video of my gaming setup slash room tour. I know back when I moved into this house like five or six months ago, I think it's been like four or five months actually, uh, I told you guys I'm gonna do a gaming setup in a room tour once I get this thing set up the way I want it. I've sort of been, you know, gathering money and stuff to be able to buy a few more things to, uh, you know, add to it. And it's pretty much exactly where I want it. I'm still gonna add a few more things in you know, I'll probably show another video one day in the future, one uh, if I ever like change things, you know, drastically. But for now, I love my setup. I love the way my room's coming together. I love it 10 times more than the old setup. I have videos of that. If you want to go back, probably just look up risky gaming setup and they'll pop up. But yeah, a lot of you guys wanted this back when I uh, first announced that I moved into a new house. They're like, hey, risky, you should, you know, show us your room and stuff once you move in and um, yeah, I'm gonna do that. And I don't know if this video is gonna turn out good. I'm using my mom's really nice camera. Uh, hopefully she doesn't kill me for using this thing, but it's got a really nice microphone on it and it's got really good quality. So yeah, I figured it'd be better to use this than just my iPhone 6 junk. But I guess we'll uh, we'll start over here uh, at the door, obviously, you know, the door, cool. Um, got the dresser, just put this thing together. Pretty nice, pain in the ass to put together though. Um, you know, got the, got the shenanigans little, uh, I can't see, I'm looking through the camera thing here. Um, you know, keys for truck. I drive a Toyota, I drive a Toyota truck. Damn, that quality is really good, ain't it? Holy crap, that's beautiful. Um, this looks better than my Call of Duty videos. Cool uh, Toyota model. It's basically the same truck I drive, except mine's a flatbed and it's a 95, a uh, 92. G Fuel, gotta have the G Fuel. Honestly, this is really good. The hydration, wow, I can't get over how good this quality is. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this looks really good. I've never actually made a video on this camera before, but face berry, that's really good. Got some, uh, uh, what is it called? Tropical rain. Not great. Tastes like kind of piss a little bit. Shit's expensive, but it does give you really good energy. Gotta have the, the Glade in here. Keep it clean. A little change bucket. This thing's nice. A little space heater and a little fan blowy thing. My bed's right here, so when I'm laying there on the bed and uh, it's cold in here, like normally in the morning. Just turn that little heater on for a little bit. Boom, pulls it right off. Uh, I got the hat rack. Always rocking the old like Western style hats. Love Lazy J. This is, um, I don't even remember the name of this company. Uh, Lazy J Rangeway or something like that. Whiskey bent right there and then another Lazy J. This one's really dirty from like working on stuff and shit. But yeah, Whiskey Mint hats. Sponsor, please. Love that. Nice camo jacket I got. When I went on my trip to uh, Tennessee, which is where I live now. If you didn't know, I used to live in Florida and I just moved to Tennessee. Uh, nice jacket though. Strata, I got that from Bass Pro Shop. In here is the closet. Got some guns in there, my rifle, a little storage box, my backpacks, you know, camo clothes, some grinder belts that I have in there right now because we don't have a shed. Got the uh, G29 wheel, I think. Or the, yeah, that's the G29, the Logitech PS4 edition. Uh, some flags, hat, scar audio, truck parts and stuff, and you know, just some shirts, a bunch of uh, you know, gaming equipment in there, mics, headset, and just random plugs and knife making material. Uh, this is just like a crazy, junky cluster of stuff for seats, Toyota books, shotgun shells, a little bit of everything. I, I still need to get a few more things of uh, storage, like shelves and stuff, for um, you know, just putting them there in the corner, I guess. Uh, I like these canvas. These are awesome. I don't like normal paintings, but canvas, these are really cool. There's a white tail there. I got this from Teespring. You guys can actually buy these if you go to my Teespring shop. It's a Risky logo. You can put it on your wall. It looks really good. It turned out great. You can see, um, minus the little fingerprints I got on it, but it's nice. And I think I just knocked it off level. I sure did, but another one there. Got some wood ducks. Got that from Tennessee as well. And here's the bed, nothing special. Uh, it's where I sleep, of course. Window, out there. You can't really see anything. I don't wanna show too much outside, you know, I don't wanna get swatted or whatever, because there's weird people like that. I just got this new TV for my room. I've never had a TV in my room before. Honestly, never. Uh, it's one of those Roku ones, you can watch Netflix and crap on it. Barely use it, but I just put it in there. Why is the lighting turning bad? There we go. So, boom, we got the crib. I'll show you guys the LED lights in a second. Well, we'll go over here to the setup. This is the, the, the place where I sit like 10 hours a day. Um, got sound foam. That little gap right there is bothering me, but 
This stuff, eh, it helps a little bit. It just looks cool. Makes your studio look a little more professional. If I had more back here, it would definitely help a lot more because when I'm talking in this journal area, the quality of audio is definitely a lot better. But once you turn over here and start talking, you can hear the echo. So this is the PC. Got a little Xbox controller right there for playing games like Forza. It's a CyberPower. Got it from Best Buy like two years ago. It's like a $1,200 PC. It does the job gets it going and uh thanks to you guys for watching the videos i could save up and purchase this thing um it's got a radeon rx 590 8 gigabyte graphics card liquid cooling 16 gigs of ram ryzen 7 2700x processor obviously you know led fans a one terabyte hard drive and a 600 watt power supply i found out it falls advertise me. That's why it sucks buying pre-built because they kind of scam you on on things. It's only a 600 watt when really it was supposed to be an 800 watt when I bought it. But it does the job. I'll probably upgrade this thing one day. I want to get 16 more gigs of RAM, upgrade the graphics card to something, and uh, definitely beef up that power supply. But overall, really cool looking case and stuff. Uh, I was thinking maybe one day I can use this case to like build my own custom PC whenever I feel like doing that. But you can change the lights pushing the button up there. I like them on blue because it's kind of like my channel color. Headset, use Astro A10s. They're all right, very uncomfortable, but they sound good. I'm gonna upgrade to something else one day. I just don't feel like spending the money on a headset. Microphone I use, this is a blue compass microphone arm. Pretty good arm. I like the little channel here for the wire. It works, it's pretty sturdy, um, and it gets the job done. Shock mount, Blue Yeti. This is the mic I use for recording my videos. It works pretty good as well. And yeah, that's the mic. Keyboard, just a Steel Series keyboard, Steel Series mouse. I think it's the Steel Series 110 series and then mouse pad. You can see the wear in this mouse pad from me like going left and right a million times. But I want to get another one of these, a bigger one that like goes over this whole thing and even my keyboard can sit on. The chair, just your uh, average office chair. Very uncomfortable after like sitting there for like three hours at a time you really start to uh, feel it in your ass cheeks. Track IR, this is for like playing American Truck Sim and stuff like that. You can use your head and that thing right there will detect it and you can use your head to move around in game. It's pretty nice, like look around or whatever. This is an Asus MG248Q or something like that, 144 hertz monitor, one millisecond response time. Uh, I think it's 23 inches or something. Absolutely love this thing. This monitor here is just a cheap $70, 60 hertz monitor, nothing special. Just to uh, have OBS open when I'm recording. I normally play here and I'll have my recording software open up here and I can watch it and make sure everything's going good. And whenever I start streaming, I'll be able to play here and then watch the game, uh, the chat and everything pop up right here. Webcam, I normally have it turned down because I feel like the FBI is watching me or something. So whenever I'm using it, I'll pop it up. Whenever I'm not using it, I'll put it down. Notebook, I go through the, these things pretty good. I always am writing down like video ideas and stuff like that. Notes for videos, things I need to mention in it when I'm recording. Found phone, boom, this is basically my view whenever I'm recording. I'll put the mic right here in front of me, you know, tweak it, make sure everything's sturdy. And then I'm sitting here like this, playing. Boom, boom, it's normally kind of blocking half of my face, just like that is basically what I see when I'm recording a video. So I really like the setup. Also got a lamp back there, but I never use that because I have LED strips and I'll turn those on in just a second. But I love the setup. It's uh, many years of my savings and stuff all put together and YouTube has definitely been a really cool blessing. It's technically my job. I make, you know, I make a good amount. I don't make a crazy amount. I'm not rich guys. I don't want to like talk about it. You know, I'm not rich. I'm broke. I'm broke basically, I am broke. <clears throat> but it gets me by. For a 17 year old, hey, this is, a, this is an awesome job. I wouldn't want it any other way, but let me close these blinds real quick because these are blackout curtains and uh, they really block a lot of light. We'll close the blind and I'll turn on the LEDs so you can see what it looks like in here when I'm uh, gaming. All right, let me go over here. We got the, the remote right here. I don't know how well you guys can see. The lights look sick on the PC though, but we hit this remote right here. Boom, you have colors. You can change them. I really like the blue and that color. It's kind of like, it looks orange on this, but it's more like yellowy orange. It's pretty. It's nice and chill when you're just hanging out and listening to music and stuff. This is my favorite color. It doesn't look as good on the camera as it does in person, but yeah, it looks so sick over here with all these colors. 
I want to change my mouse color to something else. I need to do that. I need to set it to blue. That way it matches. Yeah, they only, they stop to right there. I need to get another piece because you can connect them. This is a 32 feet, I'm pretty sure, of lights going around. But that's the setup. Hopefully you guys did enjoy this video. Something, you know, a lot of you guys have asked for. And I figured I would, you know, get my shit together and finally record it. And now that my room is kind of the point where I wanted it to be. So, thanks so much for watching. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.